Hey there, pandas. Welcome back to story time. Remember, our letter of the day is the letter E. So we're going to be looking for words that start with the letter E as we read Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. That's the title of our story. So we have our front cover. Good. What's this? Back cover, nice. What's this called? Spine, holds the book together. We have title page and another title page. It says, I can read Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch by James Dean. So remember, usually the title page has a picture, either the same picture as the front cover or another picture that has to do with what the story is about. And then the story begins right after that. Okay, I encourage you, whenever you read a book, Panda Bears, at home, if you have mommy or daddy or your grandparents or your babysitter or your nanny or big brothers and sisters read to you, I want you to show them that you know the parts of the book, that you can tell them what the front cover, the back cover, the title page, the spine, and you can tell them what else. What does an author do? Writes the words, good, and the illustrator draws the pictures. Wow, you guys are learning so much about books and vocabulary. Nice. Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch. We're on the lookout for the letter E. Here we go. <gasps> Here comes Pete. It's lunchtime. <gasps> Pete is ready to eat. <gasps> the word eat starts with the letter E. Pete is ready to eat. What should Pete eat? There it is again. The word eat starts with the letter E. <gasps> A sandwich would be nice. Yum, thumbs up if you like to eat sandwiches for lunch. Oh, I love sandwiches. Mm, I love with mustard and cheese and sprouts. Oh, I, and avocado. Oh, who likes avocado? I love avocado. Yes, Pete wants a sandwich. Pete opens the fridge. So there he is looking inside the fridge. What do you see inside his fridge? He has a fish, some bread, some milk and some mayo. Those are all of his favorites. He takes out a loaf of bread. He finds a yummy fish. So there's the bread, there's the fish. He adds tomato and mayo. Ooh, does that sound like a yummy sandwich to you? Thumbs up if that sounds good. Thumbs down if you're like, no, thank you. That doesn't sound tasty. Pete looks at his sandwich. It is too small. Something is missing. Hmm. Pete knows what it needs. His sandwich needs an apple. Ooh, we've talked a lot about apples. <gasps> Pete loves apples. So here he is. He's stacking up all the ingredients on his sandwich and he's adding an apple. Remember, we're still on the lookout for words that start with E. His sandwich needs crackers. Crackers are crunchy. Pete loves crunchy crackers. Pete looks at his sandwich again. It is still too small. He must be really, really, really hungry, right? Pete is very hungry indeed. Pete adds a pickle. Pete adds cheese. Pete adds oh, an egg. Letter E, egg. Our word of the day, egg. Two hot dogs. What? A banana and a can of beans. Wow, that's a lot of stuff to put on top of that sandwich. Something is missing. Pete adds ice cream. He takes three huge scoops. Show me the number three, boys and girls. Good job, thank you, pandas. Nice. One, two, three scoops on top of all that stuff. Wow. 
Pete's sandwich is too big for Pete to eat. There it is, eat again, starts with E. Pete wonders what to do. Pete thinks, hmm, and thinks. He's like, what should I do? How am I gonna eat this sandwich? I'm so hungry, it looks so good, but how do I eat it? I've got it, Pete says. Pete calls all of his friends. See, Pete's on his cell phone. He's calling all of his best buddies and he asks them to come over. Everyone goes to Pete's house. They are all very hungry. Pete shows them his big lunch. Are you hungry? asks Pete. Pete's sandwich is big enough for everyone. Say everyone. Everyone. That starts, it's a big word, starts with the letter E, everyone. Oh, I love that. Dig in, says Pete. Oh, he wants to share with everyone, with all of his friends. Pete's sandwich is good. Pete's sandwich is very good. Thumbs up if you think that they are liking the sandwich that Pete made. It might not sound delicious and tasty to us, but to these cats, oh wow, and this little puppy dog sounds delicious to them. Pete's sandwich is all gone and Pete's friends are full. They liked Pete's big lunch. Thanks for lunch, Pete's friends say. Thanks for sharing. I love sharing. You're welcome, Pete says. Sharing is cool. The end. End. That starts with the letter E. The end. Thank you so much once again, pandas, for listening to Storytime, Pete the Cat, Pete's Big Lunch by James Dean, and for looking for the letter E. Now, we didn't find a lot of words in this story that start with the letter E, but you might read another story and find many, many words that start with the letter. Thank you once again and make it a great day. See you soon.